my fellow Americans. No, you know what? Fuck all that bullshit. I'm not happy and I'm not excited and I'm not feeling no type of way. I just feel like this is the time now that we need to use to do what the fuck we got to do. And I know a lot of people don't want to hear the truth, but unfortunately, it doesn't matter if you want to hear it or not. It's that you fucking need it. What you want might make you cry. What you need might pass you by. Listen, okay? Listen, listen, listen. I've said August that they were not going to indict that man. They were not going to. When you looked at the evidence, the shit didn't make no damn sense. That's why Eric Holder resigned. That's why I think he resigned. That's why they never did release the, F the FBI autopsy because they know people are going to be pissed off and irritated. CNN, MSNBC don't give a fuck about people. They give a fuck about dollars. And once you start realizing, you will know how to work the goddamn system. But some of you all don't know how because you can't see the forest because of the goddamn trees. I.E., motherfuckers tearing up all these goddamn um, these police cars, these squad cars, and all that type of shit. You know what they're going to do? The police department ain't going to say nothing. But look, they tore up our shit. We need new motherfucking shit. You know who gonna, what they're going to do? The taxpayers going to have to be responsible for buying motherfucking more cars from Ford GMC. And you know who owned them motherfuckers? The same people that y'all claim to hate. White people, okay? The same people that y'all said y'all cannot stand. Y'all hate so much. And, and injustice and privilege. You all keep feeding them. You keep feeding them. And I don't think you don't understand. CNN, MSNBC don't give a fuck about y'all ass and giving y'all these little stories and saying da-da-da. They had already knew that that boy was, that Darren Wilson was not going to be indicted. They already knew, but they were not going to tell you because they wanted you to keep on fucking watching. They wanted you to keep on clicking on the story. They wanted us to keep on watching it, just like when Trayvon Martin passed away. They kept putting them goddamn... People arguing and fighting and shit because we love that type of shit. We love it. Some of us love it and we feed off of it. And we keep feeding the fucking system. And that's all I see. For you people who keep on tweeting and mad and pissed off, you ain't doing a goddamn thing. You tweeting on these folks going off and making... It's not going to do shit. It's not going to do shit the same way y'all talk. We talked and trashed the shit out of Wendy Williams and all the other folks. She still made money. That's all that matters is motherfucking money. Republicans have taken fucking majority. Fucking majority of the motherfucking House and Senate. Because you motherfuckers didn't get out and vote. You talk all this shit on Twitter and Facebook and it don't mean shit. It don't mean nothing. Put your fucking mouth. Put your fucking money where your goddamn mouth is. They don't give a fuck that you're not taking your broke ass to fucking Black Friday and putting shit on layaway. You don't need to be spending that shit any goddamn way. Because all your dumb ass going to do is ask for a goddamn payday loan in January any fucking way. And I'm pissed off as I head to work because it seems like some of you all just don't understand it. Some of us just don't. There are some people who understand that. Some of my friends, they understand how the motives and how shit work. And they won't refuse to be a part of that bullshit. But some of you motherfuckers just sit up here tearing up the liquor store and doing all this type of shit. You ain't doing nothing but instead of making the man motherfucking money. Because them shooting them goddamn gas canisters and all them bullets and shit, they ain't going to do them but order some goddamn more. And the taxpayers going to have to pay it. And them same folks who had them business, they ain't going to do them but write that shit off their goddamn insurance. And they going to move out. And you motherfuckers won't have a goddamn job. You breaking into the liquor store, you breaking into all these Walgreens and tearing up shit, ain't going to do shit. Y'all setting shit on fire, it's not finna do shit, but they ain't gonna do it, but make money. This, I mean, you steady ad, and y'all can put up these dumbass goddamn quotes like y'all think Annalise Keaton and help Darren Wilson get off. He didn't have to, and I hate to say it. I hate to say it. My friend encouraged me not to say it. But karma is a motherfucking bitch. She is a bitch, and I'm not saying such and such got it. I'm not saying who got it, but she comes around. You gonna pay. Like Don even said, you gonna either pay in the beginning or you gonna pay in the end. You're going to pay. If you really look at it, and this is how I look at it. I, don't like, I know a lot of people ain't going like, to want to hear it. But he died because he took some Swisher Sweets. And God rest their boy's soul. But you're not telling me. I have done some fucked up shit in my childhood. I've done some fucked up shit even now. But 
Was it really worth it? When you go back, sometimes the little stupid shit we do might cause us to be deaf, might cause us to die. Just like looking at my phone, looking at text messages and tweeting while I'm driving. That shit can kill me, and it was all for a goddamn retweet and a tweet. So make sure when you live in your life and you're doing some shit, make sure that it's worth it, okay? Because if you looked and you listened to the damn police scanner, when he told, when Derek Wilson told him to get out the street, he received a call and it fitted the description, description of the guy. So it would have been a different story if if uh, Mike Brown fit the like fit the description, but it wasn't him. That means he would have been profiled. But it's a difference when somebody profiling and you actually did it. So I think some people don't understand. When you profile and you didn't actually do it, then that's when you call this motherfucker here. You take their ass to court, you make them pay. But if you profile and you did it, you don't have no reason to say, hey, 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 you did it called black, but you end up doing it. I do the same shit at work every motherfucking day at FedEx. All the goddamn time. We talk, 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 and it does nothing. It does nothing because we just like to hear ourselves. And sometimes we, it's good to hear ourselves talk. But sometimes that talk don't mean a goddamn thing. So rise the fuck up. Go to the goddamn voting booth. Vote for people, for candidates that you believe is going to represent you to the best of their ability. And if you feel so pissed off and, and upset, go pull out, a, go fill out an application for the police department. Go try to run for Senate or, 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 or representative or do something. Work in the community. Do something. Because this tweet and all this other bullshit ain't doing a goddamn thing but running y'all motherfucking internet that the white man owns, okay? So when y'all got get through and doing all this type of shit, I'm not talking to black people. I'm not talking to white people. I'm talking to every goddamn body. If you try and get some shit done, you got to do it the right way. You can't do it the wrong way expecting motherfuckers to treat you right. It's not going to happen. None of this day and age. That's all I got. I'm headed to work. Y'all could be pissed off, but I'm around here getting this motherfucking money. I love y'all so much. I'm sorry I ain't been able to do no video, but I've been trying to put this motherfucking money in so I can get some money. I got to pay some motherfucking bills and I got to pay people. So I'll talk to y'all later. Deuces. Bye.